Good morning, everyone. It's good to connect up with you. Uh, all our thoughts and prayers, our eyes and ears are on uh, Glasgow at the moment, the COP26 summit, as we hope and pray that good decisions will be made for our world, uh, that we uh, will, uh, uh, both the, the decisions we make uh, in our homes and in our lives, uh, but the decisions that are made at a, at a much higher level that will help to uh, to make sure we live on the earth sustainably we love this earth that we've been given uh, uh, creation are all around us uh, and we want to leave it in a good state uh, for the next generation and generations to come speaking of which we had a few young people in uh, church on sunday uh, and we had a few pumpkins as well uh, we wanted to take what's become a real celebration of darkness and death really uh, and turn it into something more focused on God's uh, light. Uh, in, in a way, it's a strange uh, dilemma because this is a season in the church where we do focus on death, on focus on those that have died, the saints that, that gave their lives for the faith, and the souls who we remember, those that went before us, our, uh, our friends, our family perhaps, who we remember and the good things that they brought us. Uh, but the world seems to want to remember that in a in a negative way. Uh, so uh, uh, we got our pumpkins and we said, let's see if we can create more positive positive pumpkins. Uh, uh, so we we had some of our young people made smiley faces or or stars and and, and moon to to represent God's great creation. I went for the rather obvious, but still classic uh, uh, cross. Very easy to do, which was help just straight lines. But, uh, but but it does occur to me actually that this two thousand years ago this was a symbol of uh, of negativity a symbol of death and destruction uh, and in fact it was a symbol of the worst possible death that you could uh, uh, you could endure um, uh, and now it is a symbol of life it's a symbol uh, a positive symbol it's a plus sign as well but anyway we won't go into that but uh, that's which is positive. Um, Oh, there's a whole sermon in there, isn't there? But uh, I, I, we won't worry about that at the moment. Um, and so there's a sense in which uh, the Christian message has taken something negative and brought positive, taken a cross that symbolised death, uh, and Jesus has turned that around. In fact, he, he's literally taken death itself and said, uh, no, we do not need to fear because eternity is beyond. Uh, and we can't really get our heads fully around that, but the sense is we can live in hope we can live in a, a living hope in, in Christ and, and all that he's done. Uh, and, and in that, uh, it can turn something that may be uh, negative into something positive. So I think uh, I could go on, but uh, I think that's where I want to leave uh, us today. Uh, I'm sure we will encounter uh, negative things today, whether they're pumpkins with, with not very nice faces on or, or, or people dressed up in strange ways. Uh, uh, just trying to engage with this this time of the year uh, but we can bring God's light God's light shines in us and shines through us uh, and as Christians uh, that's the message we have a message of uh, hope uh, and a message uh, of love so uh, let's pray now Heavenly Father we thank you for your world we thank you that uh, uh, these pumpkins also show us part of your creation Part of the fruitfulness. And we pray this meeting in Glasgow would be a fruitful one. That there would be good decisions made and hope made about your world. Lord, we know you are, are over all. And we pray you would work in the hearts and minds of those leaders as they gather. And you would hurt, work in the hearts and minds of us uh, as we uh, think what, what our part might be to play. And above all, Lord, we pray you would... Uh, you would fill us with your Holy Spirit and enable us to overflow with your love and goodness as we go through the world, as we encounter dark places, dark uh, uh, deeds, as we encounter destruction and difficulty. Uh, I pray that you would help us to be those who seek to bring goodness. Yes, there may be a cost. Uh, but the legacy it will leave as we as we seek to shine your light in the world will be one that will be, it will be seen and, and known and and, uh, and continue on. So bless us, uh, we pray, uh, with 
with uh, uh, that living hope. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Well, bless you today and uh, look forward to uh, connecting up soon.